All right, everyone. Guess what week it is. Guess what day it is. It is opening week at the flea market. I, uh, I'm starting to pack up right now. It's almost fully packed. I have a bunch of this uh, imitation Fiesta wear. That is actually Fiesta. Huh. All right. That is not. It is ballerina. So there might be some oddball pieces in here. That looks more like it. Um, that did not have a uh, mark on the bottom. But I, I make note of this because I found a bunch of... I wouldn't say knockoff Fiesta, but unmarked Fiesta in the trash the other day. And I didn't take it. And I thought I sold it at Lambertville. And I guess this box I didn't sell at Lambertville. So I brought it out there. It didn't sell. I remember putting it out there. And I think only one person asked me. I said 20 bucks for a whole box or 15 or $10. Or whatever it was, they didn't buy it. Um, but I kind of laughed because I just saw it in the trash. And I kind of, the next day when I was kind of looking around, I was like, man, I should have just picked it up. Why not, right? Uh, so I'm going to throw it out in the van. Hopefully it sells. If it doesn't sell, it's getting donated. But uh, it's opening week at the flea market. My van's getting pretty packed. I have well over one spot right now for the flea market. Um, so we will see how well this goes. As you guys know, it's opening week. It's going to be cold. It's supposed to be 32 degrees at uh, 7 a.m. So it's going to be a cold start. Hopefully people don't have their hands in their pockets and they're willing to buy because... Uh, I don't want to come home with this stuff. That's kind of my intentions. So we'll see how well that goes. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Should be a great start to the season. And uh, here's the opening week. Let's get into it. Well, that like I never left. Ain't that amazing. Although it's very dark and you can't see, I just got out of my vehicle. What's happening, man? All right, people waiting for me. Not bad, really. Yeah. Uh, What's that? That's your stuff over there? Uh, no. No? You want this stuff? That's nice. I didn't get the morning rush in, but... I got the morning rush. I just didn't get on camera. still dark out um you want me to tell you the amateur mistake i made today you're gonna really love this one i forgot my change at home it's the first time i've done this probably about three years four three or four years um it's on my desk and uh my passive aggressiveness for today is i actually brought well i forgot them but i brought half dollars so if somebody said would you take 50 cents i was going to give them a half dollar coin back if they uh they gave me a dollar bill because I can't like it's not that I can't get rid of them but they're kind of just like a nuisance to like use out in public so yeah I forgot all my change though everything but fortunately a couple other guys here they have a bunch of extra change if I need it, I'll go over there but so far everyone's giving me smaller bills can't believe that happened rookie mistake must be my first time here Let's go see what good old Tote Man has. People always ask me, do I just leave my stuff? Who watches my stuff? I literally just leave. Um, I take my money with me, but the other stuff, whatever. Somebody wants to buy something at this point. Don't get it when they get it. I don't spend all day here, but we'll spend a couple minutes. Great. 
What's that? Do you find anything great? No, nah, not yet. Some cool things. All right, nothing really over there for me. Uh, saw a lot of stuff that I seen from previous places. All right, didn't see anything at the tow man stuff. Uh, I'm going to start doing a little bit of organizing here. I got some space for my other rolls of bubble wrap. Uh, put this. This is, I gotta display these better. Put them up on the table. These are those carousel horses. I don't wanna ship them. They're all over the board of pricing. They're all made in a country very far away. We'll box them. I still have probably like 30. Just 12.97 at Kmart. Bag? That's bag. You want bags? Yeah. Yeah. If you want, I'll give me this one. The gray bag? Mm -hmm. I want you to give me a gray bag. But, oh. S -s Squirrel residue from the warehouse. Must have been chewing on something, storing this shredded paper in there. Just realized I'm running out of battery on my GoPro. It's not good. Alright, well, the camera's dying on me. I think the last clip just got died off. But, uh, yeah, we're still here. Kind of. Probably for, like, one more clip. Let's go ahead. Alright, now we've kind of teleported back home. Um, battery, like I said, I, I I think this camera's starting to go. It was it was opening week. I had a great time at the flea market. I sold a bunch of stuff. I still have, well, now I have all these empty boxes and stuff. Um, Mark guy who sits up next to me um at least today he sat next to me he bought the remaining stuff but i tell him you know if there's anything that's garbage doesn't want to take don't take it i'll get rid of it um the uh the funny thing i would say though is those fiesta wear dishes didn't sell so i know i had that box at lamberville i had it here for some reason no one wants those knockoff fiesta wear and uh I did go through it, and I found all the Fiesta plates, so I put those aside. I had to actually unwrap every single, every single box or every single piece of, uh, every single plate, I should say. But uh, I had an awesome time. I know this is kind of a shorter video. I apologize for that. Just kind of is what it is. Um, I can actually show you guys what the warehouse kind of looks like. I'm going to go ahead and take out all this stuff. So the van's now empty for trash picking. Whatever that will be. Actually, I drove back and I know I had a bunch of stuff up front. My table is bigger cardboard boxes I took out already. And um, I saw a grill out. So hopefully in the next trash picking video, that grill is still there. It looked really nice. But, yeah, first day in the books. Head up to the warehouse. Side note, when I said I wanted to do some maintenance, it's not really great because it's half shadow, half sun. Put a pretty nice rut into the ground just by 
stopping in front of the warehouse. That's, uh, although it doesn't show on camera, that's probably about four or five inches deep. So, I mean, grass will grow back summer almost, well, spring. But, good thing I didn't get stuck. All right. Other than that, that about wraps it up here. It's been fun. Uh, I totally enjoyed going back to the flea market. I think I saw pretty much everyone um, in terms of the regulars that I can really remember. Sounds awful, but I think I saw pretty much almost everyone, if not everyone, um, from all the previous years. I also just dumped off or emptied out a box of Avon. I don't know if it broke on me or what, but no matter where I walk, it smells like cologne. And I mean overpowering Avon cologne. Almost like I took a bath in it. It's starting to give me a little bit of a headache, so I guess I gotta wash my clothes. But it might just be the garbage can is just now full of Avon liquid. Yeah. Shit. Yeah, really a great day. I would say the only surprise, like I said, was selling the Fiesta wear. That stuff is Fiesta wear. See, that says Fiesta. Dude, it's gotta be me. It's gotta be my jacket. Maybe it's my jacket. I don't know. I just got like a warm whiff of it. Not a great feel right now. Not a great look. Not a great feel. Um, yeah, that's gonna wrap it up. This is my uh, this is my pile. And I did not add anything to it. Okay, so that's just really what the pile looks like. Amazing. It's going to be a fun year. I had a great time. It's great seeing everyone. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Sorry again for being a shorter episode. Um, I don't know how really to fill in the rest of the video, but camera things doing camera things. What else can you say? Anyway, thanks for tagging along. If you guys enjoy, hit the like button, subscribe down below. Here's to a great 2024 flea market season, and hopefully the rest of the year is great as well. Thanks again. Until next time, have a great day. Keep living a dream. Peace.